Good morning, fudgers. Good morning. He says, no, it's not. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 11. Um, we're getting ready to go to our local flea market to see if they have anything there that we like for either ourselves. Let me go outside here. Oh no, my little low mold fell down. Um, to see if there's anything that we like for ourselves or for our other channel where we resell said thrifted finds. <laughs> so um, I'll bring you guys along there and show you uh, some of the things that we're seeing and then I'll show you bits and pieces of our day. I did find a little something new the other day that I want to add to my collection. Look how cute. It's a mini one. I found that sitting at the Goodwill. Let's see if the price is still on it. For $1.99. Now this is a different kind of Goodwill. They still use price guns and don't charge $50,000 for things. But he looks complete there. I would tell you guys, my perfume of the day is this one. Um, it's called La Nuit, the night. Uh, looks like it says Pandora. So that's what I'm wearing. It reminds me if you like, um, I think it's Black Opium. If you like that by Kristen Dior, that's what this reminds me of. It has that kind of warm, sweet notes. Where's my messy desk? It's a little, let me turn the light on, a little behind the scenes of my craft class last night. This is how I have to rig this camera. Um, I had to get a second camera because when I go live to, if I go, I have to check it from my phone, but if you use the YouTube app, it doesn't let you go live to members only. So I had to get an external camera. Well, this does have a camera, but it points out at my face. It doesn't point down at what I'm doing. So this is kind of like the rig. And while it's a good camera, it struggles with the fine details. But once I was done, I didn't even clean up last night, but we were doing some stamping and inking and I was showing them um, some of the, the new like stamps and the new things that I got, the stuff that the stamps that Corin sent to us. And, um, but anyways, here's like a completed card. And that was just the card base. I had to, I, I like did it backwards. You should wait until, you know, everything's put together before you put like your wet medium on like the glitter. And I was like, oh, I guess I have to finish that later because <laughs> I did it early. Then there's this one. And this one. So this is like how it starts out. That's what you guys saw me talk about in the House on Noble, um, was it day 10 vlogmas and this is just a, like this it starts off like with this stamp and like this colored paper and then this is just a card front too there's only this one was the only one that was completed so I will complete these because it was like a two for one um I was teaching them how to do something but also I needed a couple more Christmas cards because I gave my Christmas cards away that I had made recently so, um, yeah, so that's what I was doing and this is my rig, but I do need to check because they've had updates since I started the membership only videos that if I can go live from my phone, cause my phone will do so much better. And this is my phone mount when I do do craft things in like a regular video and it points down and it looks so much better, but yeah, I got a mess. I have to clean all this up. I was just like, I was tired afterwards. <laughs> I know, I was, that's pretty good.
Miss, miss, can I get your phone number? Yes. <laughs> I finally said yes instead of maybe. No. <laughs> That's a pretty set. I know. Everything I like is $75. You no know better. <laughs> Harley Davidson shoes. That's a turtle. All right, so I was able to get you a smidgen of the little, it's not the regular flea market we film in. It's just this little flea market that we like to go to. Um, but golly, did they have some loud music today? He was like, you want me to shoot the speaker out? I'm like, yes. Yeah. So that and, um, it was like 40 something with a breeze and my fingers were frozen so i had to stick my hands in my pockets yeah, but we're not conditioned for this stuff but we we did find a few cool things there that um and we, we didn't a lot of cool things there right? yeah well um i was gonna say not most of it is for um for us to resell on our other channel there wasn't anything there that we were going to keep for ourselves sometimes we can find something um but it's got to be I'm a little different with my stuff um, but now we went over to the post office and we actually picked up some uh, packages that were in our PO box so thank you guys so much for sending over um, whatever those are gonna end up being and um, we went to the bank and had to make a deposit to pay some bills and now we're heading over to Erin's mom's house and uh, I'm gonna get some footage of her new kittens for you guys and I think you guys will like to see them and an update on they're bigger now, a lot bigger now. My squeaky smooshy. We haven't heard anything yet this morning. His surgery is scheduled for today, um, but over the weekend, or I think it was Friday or something like that, um, they just couldn't get him to eat, and they thought, you know, maybe the catheter is so uncomfortable, it just has him feeling really bad, and so they took his catheter out to see if after a few hours if he would feel good enough to eat um, but they still had to make sure that his bladder wasn't filling up too much that he was able to get something out of his bladder um, so they called back and they said um, he ended up did eating his uh, food that they gave and that there was a little bit of um, pee pee in his litter box that was in his cage so both of those are really good signs I thought for sure that it was like him giving up you know thinking my parents are never gonna come get me type of thing so um, yeah we haven't heard anything today but if we do while I'm filming still I'll definitely let you guys know This thing, watch. <laughs> oh my goodness! Craziness. This is craziness. Like a lot of. You You're guys, so much bigger than last time I, know, I saw you. you. So big already. Oh yeah. my goodness! You're growing like a real weed. What's their names again? Louie and Lily. Okay, there's Louie. 
Here's Lily. Yes, she's the crazy Lily used one. She's be little, but she's actually grown, but. He's more calm. Yeah, he's, he's laid back a little bit. So. <laughs> so this one is. She looks like a climber. Oh, yeah. Oh. She, she's the one that climbs our legs and hops up on the counter. Yep. <laughs> Don't let go. I'm trying to play with oh, it. Yeah, she's finally determined to get up there. I think she, didn't you say she had y'all's pack of hot dogs all tore up oh, on the floor? Yeah, yeah, that was horrible. <laughs> she I likes like the hot dogs. I had a nightmare on that one. Didn't ever want to eat a hot dog again. Oh, oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> yeah, she's so sweet. Ah. <laughs> Worker over there. Oh, I forgot you were doing it. What? Gonna film? Filming. Yep. <laughs> so we're gonna I didn't get a script. No, there is no script. There's no script. Hey, this this show is not scripted. It's scripted, guys. No, 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 no. She's not. full of it. No. So um, we're getting ready for our sale that we have. So we pulled some items. I'm actually short. I think two things. So after I write them all down on these pieces of paper that. Pamela Blanchard created and gave to Katie and then Katie gave to me. <laughs> um, then I have to pick a couple more items from our we got that box stuff of dogs over there. Too. We do. We do have some doggies. Y'all see anything over here you want? <laughs> you want some Star Wars figurines or Ghostbusters or... Yeah. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Not the funnest of things for House on Noble, but this is part of our day. Hey, you got that two down there you can do the one that was never paid for oh we have two things that weren't paid for that that's we can right. open mm. <laughs> so those are two things right there yeah there we go all right so i'm gonna get to work and uh i don't know what i'll film next we'll just have to see all right i have to clean up this mess because i want to get a few christmas presents wrapped i have a handful of things that a lot of um well a handful of things that a few of my subscribers from my other channel there that makes more sense <laughs> um have sent the kids for christmas so i want to get a few things wrapped up um aaron took the words right out of my mouth i was thinking that like i don't know maybe like a day or two ago and then i was like he said today hey do you want to wrap a few of those things up so we could get something under the christmas tree so thankfully we have that and that's what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna clean this up first camera that's where I had you sitting um, I'll have to find somewhere for these these are beautiful one of our subscribers sent me these um, and then I have these little bits that came with generally when I get something for the season or if I'm going through like my craft stash 
and I pull out stuff for that particular season, I do something like this and stick it in a bin on my desk because it's something I want to try to use this year. So I pretty much have my desk cleaned up. So now I can, the presents I have to wrap, they're small. So it's not like I need a big work surface. So I can turn on a little Christmas movie and get a few of those wrapped so I can get some stuff under the tree. Um, I have my coffee. I do put marshmallows in it this time of year because it's so cute. I just have to bring in my hair ties and my earrings and we're good to go. Look at these two. So that's some little presents that I'm going to wrap right there. Um, I do have some wrapping paper. This one I would use special for Bianca. It's It gets glitter everywhere, but it's pink with snowflakes. See, look. Um, and then I have like brown paper because this we we can use for our packages or I can stamp on it and make my own pattern. But I have all of these. And then um, I got two at Dollar Tree. So I have a few I can choose from that are pretty nice. Okay, so believe it or not, I don't have any Christmas tags. So um, I think, and I don't have any bows. So I think, uh, I don't have time to make paper bows. So I'm just gonna tie some, you know, and like put it on here. I don't really have to, you know, kind of is what it is, but um, it kind of makes them a little more pretty and a little more special. Not that the kids are gonna remember the wrapping paper, <laughs> um, but I know the wrapping paper, so. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. And I have a couple paper punches. I can make my own tags. So, okay, that's what I'm gonna do. I have this one that I thrifted, um, probably at like red, white, and blue or something, but it's shaped like an ornament. These actually had stamp sets to go with it. I don't have the stamp set, but if I punch it out of like a coordinating paper, maybe like a red or green or something, it should look just fine. So yeah, that's what I think I'm gonna do with that too.
uh, the two that I was wrapping, I get like almost done and I noticed on the gift, like the gift paper that Amazon sends that these were actually for her birthday. So she's going to get, I usually try to keep that separate, like birthday wrapping and <laughs> Christmas wrapping. Um, so she's going to get Christmas wrapping for these two so that I could give them to her on her birthday. I totally missed that. Um, but that's okay. She'll be fine. I just won't stick them under the tree yet. But, um, anyway, as you can see, I'm not a professional gift wrapper by any means. Uh, I was kind of struggling to make my own kind of thing, to make it go my way. But that's what I was able to come up with, with not having any bows or tags or anything. But again, these were supposed to be birthday. Um, so... I won't put those under the tree, but I have a couple more that I could put under the tree. All right, guys, that is going to be it for the House on Noble vlogmas. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a bit of our day. I have to go actually get ready for our other channel now and um, make sure you guys leave your thumbs up and your comments and all your good vibes and your prayers for squeakers. We still haven't heard anything. Aaron's tried to call twice. And they've not answered the phone, not even the answering service, and they haven't called us yet today. So, <sighs> I don't know. Um, I'm nervous for him. I keep thinking about him. He's in my thoughts, like, constantly. So, you guys keep him in your prayers as well. Um, I'm hoping that with this extra long stay that it's not going to bankrupt me. Um, but anyways, <laughs> make sure you guys like and subscribe. And be sure to check back tomorrow for our next Vlogmas video. Okay, good night. Bye.